Please welcome the incredible Morgan Freeman. Very popular. Very popular. There's a reason for that. I know. <laughs> <laughs> well, Mr. Freeman, thank you for being here. It's on my the great show. pleasure to see you ladies again. In your career that spans almost six decades, uh, you've done really cool projects. But this new series, Life on Planet Earth, is remarkable. What drew you to this? <laughs> You want the truth or should I make something up? No. Both. <laughs> well, the truth. Which one's more interesting? <laughs> <laughs> now, um, I'm one of those people who's very, very interested in this subject, life on the planet. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. You understand that today, life on the planet is in a little bit of trouble. Mm -hmm. And we're the cause of it. Mm -hmm. That's right. There have been, if I remember correctly, six extinction level events oh. on the planet since life began. Mm -hmm. I mean, six times, large, large portions of life, not human life we're talking, we're talking just life, oh. gone, destroyed. Yeah. We're headed for another one. Oh. Scientists have said, if we don't hurry up and change our ways, there's going to be a cataclysmic event mm -hmm. that will wipe many of us off the face of the earth. God. It's Including scary. This is true. Well, you look back, and this series does that. How far back does life exist on this planet? Mm -hmm. And why does it still exist? It is because life is tenacious. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Life. We're not talking about human beings here. We're talking about the planet. Yeah, yeah. She'll stay. Yeah. Well, it's tenacious if we would just leave it alone. <laughs> leave it alone. I mean, the human can, can, uh, 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 you know, interruption of all of that is what's causing all the problems. I hope that it's not too late. But let me ask you this, Jeff. Did you... Did seeing the rise and fall of all these species, because some are coming in too, right? Mm -hmm. And many are leaving mm -hmm. the planet. Mm -hmm. Did that change your perspective on life? My perspective on life? I don't think it changed my perspective. It just enhanced it. Mm -hmm. Because for a long time now, I've been listening to what they say about, you know, I drive an electric car. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Yeah, me too. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you know. Yeah. Um, and no, it did not change my no, perspective. No. You've always been concerned. Uh, well, yeah. yes, yeah. Uh, always. It's relative. Uh, how far can you go back with always? You know? yeah. yeah. Well, this documentary is just visually stunning, and I, I'm just blown away by the special effects. And you've been in so many amazing films and had exposure to uh, the special effects. Were you blown away by how realistic and lifelike this turned out? You know. I know that there were no human beings standing there filming <laughs> no. these guys. No. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I know that. <laughs> Maybe not. <laughs> it's good. Well, they have the bones. They, right. they reconstruct. It's, well, it's beautiful. I, it's, yeah. it, it's what we can do now with yeah. technology. Right. You know? right. And it's, it's just the most amazing kind of stuff. I, I, I want to ask you about a different document. Go ahead. Um, as some politicians around the country try to erase black history, mm -hmm. you're making sure people don't forget vital parts of our past. Yeah including this documentary that you executive produced called 761st, did I get that right? Yeah, 761st Tank Battalion, the mm -hmm. original Black Panthers, yeah. mm -hmm. oh. about the first black battalion to fight in World War II. First black armored battalion. Yes, yeah. and you served in the Air Force, I, mm -hmm. I know that. Um, this film was then very personal to you. Oh, yes, and, heavens. Uh, I, movie buff from early childhood, I saw my first movie when I was like, six years old, mm. uh, it was uh, King Kong. 
Oh, that was a good one. Scared the hell out of me. <laughs> I did. Um, but I just movies, movies, movies. Yeah. yeah. And you know, start in the 40s and move up. And how many times did I see black people in the movies? And if I did see them, mm -hmm. what were they doing? Yeah. They were, <laughs> yeah. They yeah. were servants. Servants. Like, they were always. Uh, I yeah. know. It's it's a, it's a, appalling. I can give you the name. If you watch yeah. old movies, yeah. Betty Davis movies are particularly, even though she's great, that and it's the period. It's not her time fault. That it's the, the movies period. Yeah. It's, it's it's upsetting to watch. Doing. Tell you the well, truth. Well, it shouldn't be that way it because is. somebody did make money. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> and now it was. That's the time. Was now look at today. Things are, uh, we're always in flux. Yeah. 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 Always. But we've always been here. Yeah. <laughs> Fluxing out. Flux. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. I had a question, but they, I, we run out of time. Listen, this is extraordinary, this yeah. documentary. Oh, yeah. 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 I, 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 keep I agree. making it's all the documentaries important. that your fingerprints are on. And we thank you for coming. You're always welcome at this table. Always. Thank you. The new series is called Life on Our Planet, and it's streaming now on Netflix. Yeah. So please, do yourself a favor. You know you're watching other stuff. <laughs> Watch this. It will scare you a little bit, but give you a little bit of hope also at the same time.